And, and uh, how has it drifted from those principles? Um, just look at the policies that are, that are enacted. The health care bill, that's not what is in the Constitution. All these bailouts, that's not in the Constitution. America, the history of America, is that an individual can prosper on their own, not the government helping the individual get there. I want them to leave us alone. We can, we'll be fine on our, on our own. I think we can make our choices ourselves. The government can't make the choices for us. It's a bad deal. I wish members of Congress had read the bill before they voted on it. It's not just the health care bill. There's so much in it. It's ridiculous. I, in order to, to pay to, to keep taxes lower. What would I like to cut? Well, I think everything really, like, I mean, even the, the president said, line by line, go through everything line by line. I would love to be able to see everything line by line to know what to cut. The truth is, we don't use any entitlement programs, so I don't feel, I, I don't understand at this point, we don't use any, I don't know where the money's going. So maybe, like, somebody who is sitting at home and just taking the money, and oh, that one lady, I can't remember her name, Jasper, who is, uh, I can't, her last name is Jasper, and she's in a Section 8 housing with a big screen TV, hardwood floors, and she hasn't worked in 57 years. For 58, she's 58 years old, and she's been in the system for 57 years. In the system! No, we don't pay taxes. We know cars. This is a very we love cars. We build them. We drive them. We collect the them. We fix them. I don't know what to cut They're because I don't use any entitlements. I'm just paying for everybody right now. The you can cut is 92 what? weeks of unemployment benefits. That's a lot. That's a lot. And then we understood what was going on. So you think they should cut unemployment and that would that would help bring down the tax rates? We should limit it to a few, a few weeks. Well, what has happened is you know, one third of, of the private sector. Oh, I, I don't know. I don't. I don't believe in Republicans either. <laughs> I really think. Yeah, it's the conservatism. It, it, you, you have to have your morals and values. 